If your ping keeps sabotaging your plays and your connection feels like the real enemy, it's time to take control. In this guide, we're diving deep into the best network adapter settings that unlock your PC's full internet potential, slashing ping, eliminating lag spikes, and giving you the smooth, ultra-responsive gaming experience you deserve. No more excuses, just pure, unstoppable performance. Let's fix your bad internet and dominate your games. What's with the lag and high ping while you play games? So guys, you need gear up booster this is the ultimate tool to lower your ping boost stability and give you zero lag pro players like asian jeff and polarized use it to stay ahead so why not you download gear up booster now from the link in the description and dominate every match step one identify and close bandwidth hogging background apps before blaming your router or ISP, it's important to check what's happening inside your PC because more often than not, it's background apps and Windows services silently eating up your internet. These hidden processes create constant network activity, disrupting the real-time connection between your game and its servers. The result? Ping spikes, rubber banding and sudden lag even with a good connection. In this step, we'll use a built-in Windows tool to monitor and shut down bandwidth hogging apps in real time. Start by right-clicking the Windows icon in your taskbar and selecting Task Manager. Once it opens, switch to the Performance tab on the left side. Here, you'll find an option called Open Resource Monitor. Click it. This advanced tool gives you a live overview of how your CPU, disk, memory, and network are being used. Now switch to the network tab. Here's where the real optimization begins. Under TCP connections, you'll see a live feed of apps using the internet, along with their latency, ping, and packet loss data. Look closely here. Apps like cloud sync tools, launchers, or background updaters often show up with high latency. If something unnecessary appears, close it to free up your connection. Next, check the Network Activity section. This shows which programs are using the most bandwidth right now. If a browser, cloud service, or updater is active while you're gaming, it can instantly ruin your ping. Right-click the offending process and select End Process. For apps running multiple processes like Discord, Steam, or Chrome, use End Process Tree to fully close all related services at once. Be sure to check for svchost.exe as well. These are Windows system services. While most are essential, some might be running background updates or telemetry during gameplay. If one of them shows high network usage, note its PID and research it later to see if it's safe to disable through services.msc or task scheduler. After this cleanup, your network will no longer be hijacked by background tasks. This instantly reduces ping spikes, improves consistency, and ensures that your connection is fully focused on gaming, not syncing, updating, or uploading in the background. Step two, apply advanced network optimization pack. Now that we've unlocked firewall access for your games, it's time to take your network performance even further with advanced gaming specific optimizations. These tweaks don't just boost speed, they directly target high latency, packet loss, and unstable ping that ruin competitive matches. Whether you're facing sudden lag in Fortnite or random disconnects in Valorant, this next step fixes hidden bottlenecks within Windows and your network settings. Start by downloading the Ultimate Network Boost Pack directly from my official website. Head over to optopacks.com, click on the FPS Boost tab, and locate the pack titled Ultimate Network Boost. It will have the same thumbnail as shown in this video. Once found, just hit download. It's a fast, one-click process with no extra steps or setup. After downloading, open the folder named Network Registries Optimization. Inside, you'll see three registry files. Prioritize game traffic, optimize TCP, network throttling disable. Double-click each one and press yes when prompted to install. These registry tweaks are crafted to reduce latency, eliminate bandwidth caps, and ensure your PC always prioritizes game traffic over background tasks. Next, go back to the same folder and locate the file called lowping.bat. 
right click on it and select run as administrator. When it runs, it will reset your Winsock catalog, which clears out corrupted or bloated network configurations caused by old software or driver issues. This helps remove underlying delays and ping spikes. The script will confirm that the reset was successful and prompt you to restart your PC, but don't do that just yet. Minimize the window for now, as we're not done. Now, launch the tool called TCP Optimizer, also included in the pack. It's one of the most advanced utilities for tweaking internet behavior. Once it opens, select your active network adapter, like Ethernet or Wi-Fi. Then, at the bottom slider, move it all the way to the 100 plus MBEPS mark. After that, click Optimal Settings and apply them. This creates a stable base profile for low ping gaming. After applying the base settings, switch to manual adjustments to fine tune every layer of your connection. Disable auto tuning, meant to improve data flow, but in games it often causes lag. Disable scaling heuristics, it can interrupt your throughput on gaming networks. Set congestion, control provider, to CTCP, better than cubic for fast and stable gaming. Then scroll down and disable RSS receive side scaling, RSC receive segment coalescing. Both are meant to shift load from the CPU, but they often backfire during high speed gaming sessions. Set the TTL time to live to 64 for more consistent routing across different servers. Now turn off checksum offloading, chimney offload, large send offload. These features are supposed to enhance performance, but they usually create stutter and packet delays in competitive games. Also, enable TCP 1323 timestamps for better handling of high latency scenarios. Finally, open the advanced settings tab and do the following. Disable network throttling index. It can silently cap your bandwidth. Set system responsiveness to gaming, so Windows prioritizes your games over background traffic. Once everything is applied, restart your PC to lock in the changes. After this full process, your system will be tuned to prioritize game data, reduce ping spikes, and eliminate network throttling, giving you a stable and responsive online gaming experience, even on weaker connections. To get started with Gear Up Booster, Download the tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, Return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the middle server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the Not tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 3. Ensure full game access through Windows Firewall to prevent connection blocks. Let's talk about a hidden culprit that quietly ruins your gaming. Windows Firewall blocks your game's network traffic. By default, Windows doesn't always allow full internet access for games, especially when switching between public and private networks. This can cause random ping spikes, lag, and disconnections, even on a stable connection. The firewall tries to protect your PC, but ends up interfering with live server communication that games like Fortnite, Valorant, or CS2 rely on. In this step, we'll ensure your game has full and unrestricted access through the firewall to fix these hidden issues. First, click on the Windows search bar and type Allow an App. From the results, click on Allow an App through Windows Firewall. 
Once the window opens, click on the Change Settings button at the top to unlock editing permissions. Now, scroll through the list of apps and find the game that's giving you issues, such as Fortnite or Steam. If it's missing from the list, click Allow Another App at the bottom, then hit Browse and navigate to the game's .exe file. Once added, make sure both private and public checkboxes are ticked. This ensures your game communicates freely across any network type without being limited by the firewall. Once done, hit OK to save the changes. After applying this, your game will no longer face silent connection blocks from Windows Firewall, resulting in smoother server handshakes, reduced ping spikes, and fewer connection timeouts, especially in competitive matches. Step 4. Unlock reserved bandwidth to maximize internet for gaming. Did you know Windows reserves a portion of your internet bandwidth, even when you don't need it? By default, up to Twemacent is set aside for system tasks like updates and telemetry. It might not sound like much, but during intense online matches, that reserved bandwidth can cause unnecessary ping spikes. In this step, we'll unlock that hidden portion and make sure your games get the full bandwidth they need for smooth performance. Start by pressing Windows plus R on your keyboard. In the Run dialog box, type gpdit.msc and hit Enter. This opens the Group Policy Editor, a powerful tool that allows you to configure advanced Windows settings. Once inside, follow this path. Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, Network, QoS Packet Scheduler. Here, double-click the setting called Limit Reservable Bandwidth. A new window will open. Select the Enabled option. You'll now be able to modify the bandwidth limit percentage. Change it from the default 8% to 90%, which tells Windows to reserve only 10 cents and free up 9% of your bandwidth for real use. Click Apply, then OK, and close the Group Policy Editor. By doing this, you're overriding Windows' hidden bandwidth limit, giving more priority to real-time applications like games and reducing the amount held back for background tasks. After restarting your PC, this change will allow your system to utilize more of your total internet bandwidth for live gaming, downloads, and streaming. You'll immediately notice fewer random ping jumps, smoother match connections, and an overall more stable online experience. And that's a wrap. These tweaks should give you lower ping, better speeds, and a much smoother gaming experience. If you found this helpful, hit the like button, share your results in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more powerful tips.